Introducing Super Pixel. So um, this was a request, actually I'm not, um, this is just a prototype at this point. This is a request mainly from the do-it-yourself crowd and this thing's actually pretty heavy. They wanted to be able to cascade multiple um, LED panels together. So, so this display is a 64 by 64 resolution or 4,096 LEDs. So massive amount of LEDs here. Um, thanks to my uh, good friend and partner on this project, Itai, he was able to uh, crank out some firmware, firmware modifications to get this guy working over the weekends. It is a pretty cool display, I have to tell you. Um, there's a lot of art out there that, that you can take advantage of in 64 by 64. You just, you just get more pixels, basically, um, this being one of them. And it works the same way, um, just like the, uh, the other pixel unit, you set it from your phone. So let me go ahead and launch one here. Okay, so let's pick another one. So let me hang this guy up on the wall and I can show you a few more examples. So now let's take a look at what's under the hood of this guy. Okay, this guy is heavy. So um, this is four LED panels cascaded together. And I had to make a custom power cable because the power cables I just had just had two connectors on them. So just splice them together, no big deal. And then these are just daisy chained. So this is the output of the board. And so you can see this cable here. This is going to panel number one. This is the input, and then this is the output. So output here, input, output. This is panel number three, and this is panel, the last panel number four. So it's pretty easy to wire them. And then the other thing that's pretty neat is because they have four panels, um, there's, no, there's nothing stopping you. You don't have to put them in the square. So for example, you could have had them like this, one, two, three, and four, so vertical, or you could have had one, two, three, and four all the way horizontal, or even if you don't want four, you could have one, two, or one, two. That's all supported in the software. So uh, that's kind of a neat feature, I think. If you're an installation artist and you want to do something interesting with a lot of LEDs, potentially one solution for you.